So, I want a taste of the Big Apple, but first, the Big Apple needs a taste of me. So today I'm going to make a meal ripe for the American taste buds, made with all the experiences of my life. So, New York is called a melting pot of culture, and uh, first called New Amsterdam, that's where I get these Dutch potatoes. I'm currently on exchange in the Netherlands for seven months, and I get a little bit of a cultural melting pot myself. I get a Brazilian coffee and English breakfast tea. I also live with an American. Hello. And he showed me the American sensitivities to honesty or salt. Thanks, Paul. The study tour in New York will allow me to experience the same cultural diversity that I have here in the Netherlands, but with more career-focused agenda. I had some experience before this. I worked at DD Digital for a week, seeing the clarity into the industry that I was destined for. That's where I get these carrots. And then, after this, I worked at Isobar, enhancing my skills, working with brands such as Liquorland and Disney. But, New York is more than this. It's life on steroids. It's, would you like fries with that? That's where I get my passion, my work ethic, and my fight. New York is also collaboration. That's where I get the lemon. The pink lemon, in fact. That's the business I started in Melbourne, where I collaborated with 40 different fashion designers and artists to create two pop-up shops. Six months, we got 4,000 Instagram followers, and then we sold out our, half of our fashion inventory in the opening night. This was the first time where I was both the creative and the client in an advertising campaign. I bring these ingredients into the study tour of New York. Devotion to the client and my team. But teamwork is nothing without leadership. Like the garlic, leadership, like my art captaincy in high school, school captaincy in primary school, the student staff consultative committee is very much like a garlic. On its own, it's quite ugly and gives you bad breath. But with the right ingredients around you, you get the perfect combination. And that is where we get the end product of the perfect American meal made with the experiences of my life.